questions then we will move on to the third interview question third interview question is which scenario you should not automate so there is al always you should define what is scope automation or what is not in automation scope because if you are not going to clearly bifurcate yourself what kind of test cases you can automate what kind of test cases you cannot automate otherwise we will be always in the dilemma whether to automate this test case or not then we will be spending unnecessary time for uh, automating a wrong test wrong test case right so this kind of efforts we should not get wasted rather than first itself you should define so what kind of scenario you are really going to automate and what kind of scenarios which you are not going to automate right let's let me go with the detailed explanation how to answer this question if any test cases let's say if any feature which is not going to change and it is very simple if you just execute one or two times then that is more than enough then uh, uh, this not this is also not a very critical feature or not an important feature at all then bringing automation is, is not at all is going to change worth right yeah, because this test this feature is being implemented and it is only required to test it one or two times then automation is not the right candidate to bring the automation right that is one that is where you should not go and automate then the second is if the application is getting change too frequently especially during development phase we should not go and try to automate because especially i am talking about ui level test cases i am fine if you are going bringing automation in uh, api level testing but it is always advisable to pick the models which are not changing very often otherwise the effort which is involved in modifying the scripts or updating the scripts again is a huge challenge hence we should not pick up that kind of test cases as well then let's move on to the third important uh, cases where you should not pick for automation that is any test cases related to random testing any test cases related to monkey testing or any test cases related to exploratory testing you should not bring automation because these comes as a ad hoc test cases these test cases comes in a, a more of a out box right and uh, as and when if you come up with a detailed test cases we are able to convert them into a manual test cases in a straightforward manner then you can double check whether we can bring automation or not but straightforward you cannot go and bring automation here right these are the three important reasons are important uh, topics which can which you cannot bring automation right i hope you understood the third interview question